Hey, what's up, guys? I just want to say Merry Christmas. Have a good Christmas, guys. I really hope that uh, the new year brings you guys great stuff as well. That being said, let's get into the video here. But first, it would be great if you guys could like, subscribe, comment. Again, I want to get to, I think it's 500 or 1,000. I'm not really sure. Uh, one of my subscribers has a community tab, and he has less than... 200 subscribers so i'm not really sure why i don't have one but let's just try to get to that to a thousand subscribers let's make that the goal i think we can do it maybe not anytime soon but hopefully we're going to be talking about efap fanboys and i'm going to be responding to them unfortunately this one's going to be uh, kind of off the cuff here i don't have very much time to make this video but i wanted to put one more out before i uh, i'm leaving for about five days from my house i'll be away from my brand new pc i built by the way it's got a 3070 in it. It's a beast. I'm loving it. Um, this is my second day using it. Um, so yeah, I want to uh, just pump one more out for you guys. Maybe tie you over until I get back. I'll be gone for roughly around five days, like I said. But yeah, let's uh, let's just get into it. Uh, let's look at some of these comments here. Um, here, which one do we want to start with? This is the one that really wanted me to make the video, so I'll find uh, where it was, I think... Alrighty, a lot of the comments are getting deleted because um, people are name calling and it's unfortunate. But basically this guy, he was just Raindrop Media, great guy. He's one of my subscribers. He's also in the Discord chat. He's a great dude. Um, yeah, he just said, I respect you. Uh, and that like I took a basically a, I played devil's advocate essentially. Like I, um, I saw both sides of it, but for sure I was more leaning towards Synthetic Man's side because I just didn't feel like it was fair unfortunately so yeah that, that that kind of uh is unfortunate um i know i i kind of had a bit of a bias here but i tried to play it as fair as possible um but the thing that i want to get here with is let's see so this joshua chitwood that's how you say it um said Mahler does not take people out of context if you bothered to see the video, you might notice the guy you're defending is very racist, homophobic, and anti-Semitic. Mahler was looking into the guy to make a response video and ended up finding all of that in one series of streams and videos he did. Know who you def who you defend. I do know who I defend. Unfortunately, um, I probably spent too much time defending. I'm not defending. I probably spent too much time watching Synthetic Man because I would really like his style. I think I've said this before. I really am trying to model my style after him maybe make it a little more watchable and digestible um i'm not as uh edgy let's just put it that way um and so i responded i said ha huh, don't tell me what to do i have a bit your i have my opinion you have yours uh you're obviously missing context as well because he's not always like that my point is with that when i said that is he's not always like this for sure he was in this stream um but yeah it, uh, he's definitely that's it's just been as of recent, but beforehand, he's definitely not been this bad. And he's definitely not racist, homophobic, and anti-Semitic. Um, he definitely says jokes towards them and uh, at their expense. Um, I wouldn't say that he uh, is super... I wouldn't say that he's a, an ally, per se, but I don't think that he hates people just because they're gay. Um, maybe I'm looking into it too much. I don't know. It's for you to decide, but... Anyways, uh, my guess is that you didn't watch the Synthetic Man video and only watched him after the EFAP episode. So hate watching him doesn't count. You should be more obje objective instead of dealing in absolutes. I've said this before. I don't like people who deal in absolutes, unfortunately. It's annoying. Um, it's not very fun to talk to someone like this. And you'll see it's not very... Uh, it's not very fun, this conversation. But this is exactly why I don't like this shit like i don't like dealing with uh, people that deal in absolutes and it seems like his fans or at least some of them mauler that is uh and efap um yeah they just they seem like they uh have fans that deal in absolutes a lot and then he said what comment are you responding to uh i don't nor will i ever watch synthetic man i only know what i've seen which is too much which is much too far for one lifetime and that's exactly what I said in my video. He never, he like, this proves my point beyond measurable, unfortunately. He had never seen him. They clipped it together. No context beforehand. No context afterwards. Didn't watch any other content. And now he has a preconceived idea. And so I said, that's exactly what I said in the video. The, 
that's exactly what I said in the video, gave you preconceived ideas. Th thank you for proving my point. Um, but yeah, and then he goes on to prove my point even more. He said, I had no idea who Synthetic Man was beforehand. I saw him saying terrible things and now I dislike him, that's all. I mean, that's fair, you can have your opinion, but I, that's the problem that I had with the video. Like, you don't have to like him for sure. Like, that's that's fine to me, but that is, unfortunately, like, you're just, yeah. It's not a great uh, great look to be so, uh, like a sheep, like I say later. Which I said to him, which is exactly what I said in the video, mate, you clearly did not watch it, which is fine. Um, and he said yes, so he just straight up admitted it. I was like, then why are you commenting? Like, why would you comment on a video that you didn't watch? Um, you just sound ignorant. And I call him a sheep. This is when I call him a sheep right there. Um, yeah, and then uh, he goes, instead of pointing out how I'm wrong, you result to insults. And um, I don't have to play a game to know how a game is played. Same with the video. Uh, <laughs> I mean, y it, you have to know how at least the game is played uh, to make a full judgment on it. Like it's when you're sitting through the cutscenes, unfortunately, it's it, unless you have a real interest in the game, it's really, really boring. And I enjoyed God of War 2018 like 100 percent. So and this one just it's slogged for me. But again, um, but yeah, and then I said, no, merely it just sounds like you're repeating what you heard. So you sound so it's more like a parrot, unfortunately. And I wasn't trying to be mean or anything like that. I was just purely trying to point out the flaw in his uh his argument here and i was just calling him out for exactly what he was doing i don't i don't see a problem with that i wasn't trying to push any hate or anything like that and then he goes back any insults towards me i could just throw back at you make a real argument next time and then this is the part that made me want to do this video and especially start off with this i said bro and i responded and then i responded to him said bro you're actually dense i did make an argument you didn't watch the video so you have no argument you're just echoing what you, you are just echoing what you heard from other people. At least I form my own opinion, which is like literally my whole point in the eye, like form your own opinion. Don't just listen to what other people say. Um, so yeah, unfortunately this is not the best interaction in the world. Um, I'm sure he'll reply. Um, maybe not. I, I think I dunked on him a little bit. I wasn't trying to be too mean. Um, but this comment did, uh, get me tilted a little bit. So I, I definitely didn't, I wasn't the kindest, let's just put it that way. But yeah, uh, let's continue on here. Um, this one was a good comment. He made a lot of good points. I'm not gonna read it. Yeah, I'll just pause it here for a bit um, or you can go and see it uh, and go and look at it. But basically, he's calling out everything that I said in the video. He makes a lot of good points for sure. Um, but yeah, he edited the comment and uh, he was throwing slurs at me, um, calling me as you can see, somehow this got past YouTube. YouTube, for some reason, has been censoring my comments a lot. Um, and then he said, I, you can't watch me anymore, which I think is is kind of ironic because he went and commented on another one of my videos and did continue to watch me after this. So quite interesting. And then so I responded, um, well, that's a lot of hate. Seems sort of hypocritical. You had me in the first half, but as soon as you started calling me names and stuff, uh, you lost my respect. And then he called me another name. They deleted the comment and then he said, I don't need your respect. Um, I think everyone deserves respect until you lose the respect. Um, everyone's a person. You don't need to want mine or anything. It's just interesting. And then, yeah, I, he removed some of them, uh, some of the name calling. It was quite excessive, uh, unfortunately. Um, I try not to do it, but again, I'm, I'm guilty of it as well. So it is what it is here. But uh, yeah that's pretty much the end of that exchange it's just interesting how much uh hate they have in your heart it's uh it's interesting like they just came in even with preconceived ideas about me just because i was defending the guys and it's quite interesting uh i feel but yeah let's uh continue on here this one got me mad as well um i don't see how he roasted him for four hours uh or roasted himself like you definitely uh, when you have a super cut it means that you cut it together um and then you kind of cut the context out or at least that's how Mahler did it unfortunately um there was no it was very short clips they were ripping them apart the longer clips were from the uh the review and they did have good points during the review for sure um maybe if I do a part two I'll go into it but I don't think anyone really gives a shit about this anymore so yeah that there's that um I just wanted to respond was the big thing I wanted to uh, get my two cents in um, and show you guys, you know, exactly how these people act, unfortunately. 
Um, but yeah, uh, I said this comment made me laugh. Mahler made the video that they reacted to. Did you miss that part? He literally says, we're going to watch a super cut I put together. Uh, and then he says, how does that change the fact that he showed the synthetic man contradicting himself every step of the way? Did you miss that? Oh, but it's just woke cringe. And then again, I said, well, like I said in my video, and if you watched it, uh, I thought it was unfair to a new viewer to show the wor worst moments right off the bat. It would have given preconceived ideas about him. Uh, and then they'll think that's all there is to him. But uh, and, which is merely the case I said is unfair. Like it's just not, it's not fair to do that to someone. But uh, that's my opinion. Um, and I've been guilty of this as well. I've definitely, I don't know if I've admitted it before, but I've definitely had preconceived ideas about creators um, beforehand. Sometimes they've been justified um, once I've done my own research or I guess not even research, just watching them. I shouldn't call it research, it's not that hard. Um, but yeah, it did feel more like a hit piece than anything else. He told his fans to kind of forget about this and not give any more attention to it, but uh, the views are too good, man. I'm, again, I'm a view whore, so we're gonna keep doing it. Uh, and then I said, how much of this video did you watch before making this comment? My guess is two to three minutes max. <laughs> My guess is two to three minutes max. This person said, cope and seat and enjoy. Um, interesting uh, i said what even is this comment uh to be honest i had to look it up on urban dictionary because i'm not that much of a internet person like i'm more uh i do it casually and now i'm getting more into it hardcore um and then he said uh, i said the irony is rich here um i think i'm missing some context here i don't really remember i'd have to go back and look but he definitely said something to my response here and then uh he just said i don't think the definition of irony i can't remember maybe i was wrong uh, i'm not really sure um, and then I said, no, I just don't want to sink to your level and explain it, uh, how I saw the irony, uh, this made me get me called a shitty person because I'm trying to watch myself. You know, I'm not trying to, to be part of the problem, like I said before. So I'm just going to leave it alone. He said, okay, little buddy. I said, hey, keep commenting. It's just boosting my engagement. And he said, one more person doesn't do anything, but when you're boosting it with a bunch of comments, uh, it's interesting. And then, uh, yeah, he deleted all of his comments, uh, uh, <laughs> afterwards, and I, I kind of dunked on him. Again, I, I became part of the problem as well. I said, oh, my, oh, I'm sure you know. You obviously don't like me and my, or my opinion, so why don't you go do something else with your time? Or maybe it's because you don't have anything else better to do. So definitely not the best thing I could have said, but I was at this point, it was getting a little annoying. I'm human. I make mistakes. Definitely don't be me here. Um, I'll, try to, I'll try to be better, um, but, yeah, it uh, definitely wasn't one of my best moments for sure. Um, but yeah, uh, those were just some of the, the rest of them made really good points. Like, uh, when it came to it, uh, I really didn't have much to disagree with. There was only a few points that I disagreed with cause they did have points. I didn't necessarily hundred percent agree with them, but I couldn't, that's how they saw it. So I didn't want to take away from them unless I, I, I had something in the video that directly contradicted that. Um, like again, I kept on having to reiterate myself saying that, um, I, I just don't like the fact that it would give people preconceived ideas, which I think is fine. You know, like, uh, I don't think that's an issue. Um, but yeah, maybe that's just me. Um, I don't know. But anyways, that's, uh, kind of the more interesting ones, the more interesting exchanges, the rest of them, uh, you can go and look into yourself. Uh, and again, they had really good points. I'm not going to take that away from them. They're just quite long. Um, and I, I don't think I can, uh, read them all out here, especially with the time crunch I'm on. I only have about two to three hours to finish this video before I have to take off here and uh, to drive to where I'm going to. So um, I really wish I could make this video longer. Maybe if it uh, gets a lot of engagement, I'll go into it and talk about a part two. But as for now, I think I'm just gonna leave it here um, and then we'll maybe go into it later and go into some of the better points. But yeah, I just wanted to put something out for you guys before Christmas time, maybe something to munch on, something to snack on if you will. But yeah, let's... uh. But yeah, let's just try to be kinder to each other around Christmas time here, maybe just in the future as well. Um, try not to witch hunt at all my audience. Uh, I don't really care what other people's audiences do because it kind of shows what they're standing for, but I don't want to be that. I, I want to have a positive community. I want to have an inclusive community, an open dialogue. So I tried to be as civil as possible. When I sunk to their level, uh, it was definitely because they started, <laughs> as, as childish as it sounds, it's, they started it first. So. Um, definitely not the best again, on my opinion. And I know I keep on repeating myself and I'll stop now, but yeah. Anyways, guys, just remember to like, subscribe, comment, do whatever you want. Again, you can shit on me all over in the comments. If you want, I'm not going to control what you do. 
also I, I can't say that I won't uh, fight back because I, I can be quite petty myself um, like I've said but anyways guys thanks for watching the video and I'll see you guys in the next video hopefully it'll be coming out soon here